But what up world, 502 King Pound coming to y'all with another video. So in this video, man, I'm just going to keep it real short, but I want to put out a quick message for y'all morning. Man, whatever it is that you want to do, wherever it is that you want to go in life, you don't have to look to external sources, people for that. Everything that you need is with inside of you. Everything that you need. I mean, it's a good saying that a hustler can lose it all and get it back. And that's extremely true. And the reason being why is because it's not about what you have outside of you. It's about what you have inside of you. It's about your heart and about your mind. It's about that dog, that fight. What is it that you are willing to sacrifice? Who are you doing it for? What are you doing it for? You have to find all these things inside of yourself. Because if you look for it out of other people, man, other people have a hard time even believing in themselves. So you'll be hard pressed to find people who believe in you. You might find one or two, you know, but you have to pull that from yourself. You have to. I'm going to tell you something, man. I have been through so much in my life, man. I've been through times where I was homeless before. I mean, real deal homeless. I mean, nowhere to lay my head at, nowhere to eat at. I've had, you know, situations where I didn't have a car for over a year. You know, situations like that will humble you, but not only humble you, it will make you do a lot of self-reflection. And in those times, man, I never felt like, even when I was down, I never felt like homeless Paul. I still felt like King Paul. I still thought like King Paul. And that's what allowed me to come out of those situations is because I didn't allow those situations to overcome me. I didn't allow those situations to take me over, you know, put me into depression and everything else. True enough, they were some hard times, but them hard times, them hard times is what builds us, what molds us, what makes us into a better person. So, you know, I, I thank God for the times that I went through, the, the, the crap that I had to go through, uh, because it made me a much better person, a much better man. And I just want people to know, man, regardless of what your situation is, if you're homeless, if you ain't got nothing to eat, if you don't have a, a car, if you don't have whatever, man, it does not matter. It doesn't matter. What matters is what's inside of her. Can you get it back? Are you willing to go out and fight and do what you got to do so that you can move forward in life? You know, if you got a job that you want to get, if you got a promotion that you want to get, if you want to get back into school, if you want to, you know, take another step uh, uh, and to do something else in life, you have to start within you. You can't wait on other people to tell you, yeah, you can go out there and do it. Don't wait on them. Don't wait on anybody to tell you anything. You have to wake up with that dog every single morning. Whatever your motivating factor is, if it's your kids, if it's your parents, whatever. Now, a lot of people get caught up in, you know, I don't want to work a nine to five because I'm making somebody else's family rich and all of this. But let me tell you something. You did not accept that job so you can make that company rich. You did not accept that job so you can make the CEO of Walmart's family rich. You did not accept it for that. You accepted that job to make yourself wealthier, to help yourself, to help your family. And that's exactly how you have to look at it, man. Circumstances are nothing. Circumstances are nothing. If you got to take you a shitty job uh, in order for you to move forward and do what you got to do in life, then take that shitty job. Don't look at the external circumstances. Think about, you know, what's going on inside of your life, how this is pushing you forward into the goal, you know, into the place that you want to be in life. Um, I don't want to ramble too much, man. Like I said, it's supposed to be a quick message. It's like my second time making this video because I deleted the first one earlier. Man, it was a headache. But anyways, I appreciate y'all time. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you got something from it that you can take on throughout your day. Um, please continue to like, subscribe, comment down below. I love seeing them comments, man. Let me know what you think. Let me know if you have any input on these topics. Um, also, make sure that you share the video with somebody who you feel like can benefit from this. Hey, I love y'all. Thank you so much for y'all time. Y'all have a blessed day, man. 502 King Pop.